your future and our past. I'm Claire Deering. I used to be management until things went awry. Now I'm more of an advocate. John Hammond wanted a world with dinosaurs and I want us to take care of them. I hope you do as well. Now this dinosaur is something special. Well, they're all something special. But this one stands out because of the horns on top of its head. It's called Ceratosaurus. It kind of looks like a slightly smaller T-Rex, but its bite is probably about the same. While the parks have become famous for dinosaurs, it's not quite the way we'd want. Hopefully, working together, we can change that. Sorry, I meant to introduce myself. George Lambert, security specialist. Our challenges are many, so let's not waste any time. With dinosaurs like this,
this, the Majungasaurus that can really be a handful. It's short, stocky, and lives for the hunt. This is also one of the only dinosaurs we know of that may have engaged in cannibalistic behavior. Nothing like having your friends over for dinner. Owen may come off as a bit of a free spirit, because, truth be told, he is. But he'll also tell you the truth, even if you don't want to hear it. My advice? Listen when he speaks. Owen has the experience, and he spent more time face to snout with the dinosaurs than just about anyone else. And he lived to tell the tale and brag about it. Let me introduce you to the Metria Canthosaurus. Say that fast three times. This is another alpha predator that, while not as big as some of its cousins, tends to stand more upright. So I guess it has good posture while it's tearing you to shreds. <laughs> 